welcome to Batam at night. We're just having a wonder here. Just having a walk. Trying to explore what's around our hotel. We saw several factory outlets across the street as well as some street vendors like this one in front of me here. So we're we'll trying to check it out. So follow us on this night adventure in Batam. Right across the street there is a restaurant. And across and next to the restaurant is a futsal arena. Too bad I've not got any boots on. If not, we can have a kick or two. Across the street is a hotel known as Red Door Hotel. It's a really budget hotel and we would not recommend you staying at Red Door Hotel. It's best that you stay at our place because we inquire to stay at, I mean not inquire, we look up Red Door and then we found just another hotel across the street which is about the same price but better. So around the corner here we have this place whereby there's a lot of street vendors which I believe only opens up at nightfall. Let's see what we got here. We got some nasi goreng special about a dollar. If you want to experience Batam street food, this is about 10,000 rupiah, about a dollar. But let's have a little wander around because we just ate and let's see what else here we got. It looks like there's not a lot of things happening here. Um, probably they sell satay here, bakso ayam, 5,000, which is about 5,000 is about 50 cents. Bakso ayam costs 50 cents. It's really cheap. Things here I've observed, like can food here are very cheap if you decided to have food on the street here. Just like across over there, across on the other side. We have like theme parks there. And we have warung sehat, means a healthy uh, food place. Carnival. So there's a street vape shop here. If you're into vape, you can come here. It's just next to Golden Bay Hotel. I mean, it's in front. I mean, it's quite near. It's a walking distance, about five minutes away. Let's see what else here we have. We have more street foods across this, uh, the road here. Prata sandwich. Prata sandwich. More street food here. The food, Golden City Batam. I guess today, tonight is a Saturday night. Everyone's oh, wow. at home. Korean food. Oh, there's a Korean food here as well. It says here, Jajanan Khas Korea. It means Korean street food. You like you can translate it to like to that literally. And we have banana bray, banana nugget. That sounds interesting. Banana nugget. I might have banana nugget later on. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> and we have warung crazy. Means crazy place to eat. <laughs> And we have a bumblebee. bumblebee shop here. Bumblebee. Um, they sell ice chendo, green tea for 15k, a dollar fifty cent. I guess they're not in operation tonight. There's plenty of food to eat here. You will not go hungry if you're in Batam. And we're not actually staying at the center of the city here. We're staying around the outskirts of the city here. And just take a look at all this amazing place that you can eat, relax and chill. 
more street food. We have a lake there to the left, whereby you can relax with your mate or with your spouses. And there's a rickshaw there you can ride. We have street coconuts if you can, if you want to buy. Really Love huge coconuts. coconuts. Yeah. Muda. Golden City. And I believe in front of there it looks like it looks like a, a beach, right? Oh no, it's a lake. Street ice cream there. Oh, let's check out what's happening in the distance there. It seems like we have a music concert going on in the distance here. Let's check it out. I see some woman singing in the distance. And we can hear it from here. So let's check it out. So we have the lake here to the left. And more street food for you to eat on the right. <clears throat> I'm starting to lose my voice here. Lake on the left, street food on the right, and in front of us is a music concert. There's not a lot, a lot of people here. It seems like there's a line here. Is it ticketed? So this is a lake here. You can't really see it clearly because it's super dark. But yeah, there's the music concert. We're waiting for their set to start. And people are starting to gather around here. It seems like it's going to be a big event tonight. Saturday night, I suppose. Where everyone comes out. We're still waiting for the concert to start. Or oh, we'll probably just leave before it even start. The sound man is trying to fix his um, stuff here. And I think they're going to do one more sound check. Um, I'm not sure if we'll stay. But anyway, I think this is it for me here at one of the hidden places where tourists never go here in Batam. And I'll see you on my next video then. See ya. Well, it looks like we might have a concert sooner than later. Let's give this guy a try. the mood for the night. Really interesting, really good band and a good singer as well. Look what we found here. It looks like a haunted cafe here in Batam. <laughs> what a concept. This is what we call uh, Jambalang or uh, Pontiana means uh, a woman who died with the baby in the stomach as the legend say and what we have here another one and we have um, Casper here as well interesting concept here let's take a thumbnail with this one it looks like a good thumbnail alright 
Pocong. <laughs> so interesting place here, the Golden City Batam. I believe tourists should come here more. And yeah, so I'm done here exploring the hidden path of Batam where tourists doesn't go here. And I'll see you guys on my next video. So far this trip has been amazing. And alright, I'll see you guys on my next video. I'm really gonna end it here. Now I want you to realize something here. In Batam, instead of building home, they use rope. Yeah, interesting as well. Something that you never know.